Hello, my name is Roy Elsie. I'm Chief Analyst at Omdia in the Cloud and Data Center practice. And my topic for today is 2023 Trends to Watch IT Operations. I've got five key trends to watch for 2023 that I'm going to be researching and that I predict. Um, there is a report at the back of this that you can access if you're an Omdia subscriber um, to my intelligence service and get more detail in what I'm talking about. But briefly, you're going to see the rise of hybrid cloud and on-premise as a service. Now, this on-premise as a service movement is the HPE GreenLake, the Dell Apex, the Lenovo TrueScale, which is competing with the likes of AWS Outpost, Azure Stack, Google's Distributed Cloud, Oracle's Cloud App Customer, uh, and its ruggedized edge deployment technology. Now, they're all fighting for a share of a market where the on-premises um, facilities are used, so the, the physical infrastructure remains within either a colo or within your own facility, but the capacity, the way it's funded, the management of it can be cloud-like. So you can get it as a fully managed service um, on a subscription basis with extra capacity built in. So if you need extra resources, you gain access to them. So it can be a very flexible uh, and dynamic approach. And it's one we certainly think you're going to see more of in 2023. The next operational challenge that we see people facing is the continued rise of cloud native. So you've got containers, you've got serverless, it wasn't, WebAssembly is coming. All of these have got slightly different ways of being managed and configured and orchestrated and optimized. And that means that as an IT operations team, you've got to have a tool that can stretch across all of those environments, allow you to have visibility into all of those environments, and to make sure that you're using the environments correctly for the correct workload types. So you can feed back to the developers through a DevOps process that they are using the right environments for it. The edge is another area of great concern because the edge remains a challenge. We are beginning to see the rise of edge solutions and edge ecosystems. Um, and that in 2023 will grow and make things a lot simpler and a lot easier. The environmental and social and governance aspects of IT operations and IT departments will be increasing in demand. The fact that we are expecting to see much more environmental sustainability come into the core operational tasks, but the governance and the social responsibilities particularly as we look at the world in a new light through displaced people working from home, the conflicts that are going on, it's all adding to tensions that organizations have got to manage. Um, for example, do you have operations in Russia? Is that something that your company will maintain going forward? Or are you in solidarity with the Ukraine and you've shut down your Russian operations and you've moved out of Russia? Those are the sorts of ethical questions that customers will be asking of organizations and organizations need the ability to demonstrate they are or they aren't and understand what risks and opportunities they face. And then the final one is it's the transformation of IT operations. So the you know, digital transformation for IT operations is going to continue. And it's going to be helped by the rise of AI ops, FinOps, DevOps, DevSecOps, CloudOps, XXOps technologies. Because effectively embedded AI is going to help with the roles and responsibilities. It's going to allow the IT operations teams to do more with less. And it's going to allow organizations to reskill their teams 
so they've got broader T-shaped skills. So they can stretch and they can understand the business, but there is a deep technical expertise should they need it. There's plenty more in the report and there'll be plenty more that I'll be researching next year in this. Um, uh, if you need to know more, my name's Royalsy, um, Chief Analyst at Omdio in the IT Operations Intelligence Service. Thank you very much.